Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry if I'm shaking you guys. Think we good? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl La Gordici. Oh, I am so annoyed right now. I know better. I, let's just leave it at that. I know better than to leave a drive through fast food place without checking my bag. I'm starving. I haven't ate all day. And I ordered Taco Bell for me and the boys. And I forgot to check my bag to make sure all my food was in there. Sure enough, something of mine was missing. Hi, guys. Welcome in. I missed you guys. I also do have a nice update, so I hope you guys will stay tuned for that. I got their um, Baja Blast Zero. Hi, Vic. Oh, I missed you guys, too. Hi, Karina. Hi, Yomaida. Teresa. Hi, Christy. Mommy and Milo. Oh, my gosh. Like, I haven't had it happen in a while, so I got comfortable. I ordered um, their new grilled cheese burrito, and I got nachos with cheese. I asked for an extra cheese, and I ordered my favorite, a chalupa. Didn't get my chalupa, didn't get my extra cheese. I said, oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lanta, why me? <laughs> Mama, you want to say hi? I'm here at my grandma's house today. I have a good update for you guys. I know it seems like 2023 was going downhill, but I just got some good news, so I'm feeling much better, much, much better. Um, a ver, metes, Emma. The, uh, come on this side, Nana, because okay. the doggy's over there. Hi, Sierra. I wanted to drive back, I swear, but it's traffic hour for us right now. I heard the heck. Hola, como están? <laughs> Hi guys, how you doing? Grandma missed you guys. I missed you guys a lot. Hi Brooke. Hi Minx. Hope hi you guys Amber. are doing good. They're all saying hi to you, Mama. Hi Ellen. Okay, let me go ahead and say a prayer so I can take a bite. Cause man, Father God, I thank you in the name of Jesus for this meal which you are I'm about to receive. Thank you for blessing me with the new day of life, Lord. I also thank you for. All your blessings and everything you do in mine and my children's life. Lord, I pray for those that are less fortunate and that go without. Pray for the homeless, the orphans, the widows, the widowers, the elderly, the prisoners as well. May you bless and protect them. And and I ask that you help anybody that's going through struggles, Lord. I also pray over Gordi's Nation. May you bless them and help them as well. In your precious son's name we pray. Amen. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, hi, Sarai. I missed you guys. I haven't, tr I've been wanting to try this dang burrito. Hi, Philip. But I have never gone around to it. I guess it's with chicken loaded with cheese on top. I wish it was more fluffed up, but it's kind of flat, but it's okay. We're going to work with what we got. <laughs> <laughs> Heidi, aloha. Mm. Okay, it's all right. Hi, Mimosa. Hi, Step Flow. I hope you guys have had a good week. Um. Yeah, so we're going to get some bites in. I'm so excited to share with you guys. You don't even know. You guys get the natural Irene. No makeup. My cheeks are red because it's been really cold outside. Hi, Kat. Hi, Roxana. Um, I also seen they had a, a green... What was it? What was the box you guys were going to get, Christopher? Huh? Um, the box. I don't know what it was. The deluxe craving box, but it came with a green chili burrito. I seen that. Ashley's World. Grandma is doing a little bit better. Can I say, Mom? 
Grandma was almost going to have a panic attack this morning because of all the stress yesterday night, too. But she's feeling better. We're letting God handle everything. Oh. But, yeah, I've been wanting to try that green chili uh, burrito. And I was just going to say that, Alex, they have, I think it's because of the Super Bowl. God, I don't remember what it was. But I seen they had wings and something else. It wasn't just plain wings. It was wings and something else. Okay, this burrito is pretty good. I wish there was more filling. It has chicken. It looks like rice. It's not bad. Hi, Jacindy. How are you, beautiful? I'm doing better. Better today. Sorry, guys. The wings are bomb. I'm going to definitely have to try those. From Taco Bell? Mm-hmm. They have wings, and I, I don't know if it was a Mexican pizza or something with wings. I, I don't know. Really? Oh, Christy, I hope you feel better. Hi, Sherry Berry. What did they forget in your order? Yeah. They forgot my chalupa, and they forgot my extra cheese, and a Dorito taco. I forgot about the Dorito taco. I said, you know what? There's traffic right now. I'll just go tomorrow for my refund. I said, I'll take a picture of my order. I got my burritos and everything. I thought I was missing a burrito, but my son had already took it to the room. I'm so sad for you about your chalupa. I was craving that so bad, too. Thank you, Gussie. I check YouTube every hour looking for a live or video from you. Hope you're doing well. Thank you, Veronica. I'm doing better. I was really stressed out. Really depressed. I felt like problems were piling on top of each other. But from the one you guys seen, I've moved on. What I want to talk about is number one, me and my husband are no longer together. Not because I chose it, it was his decision. Me and him have been together in April. We were gonna be going on 15 years. I don't wanna say anything bad about the situation because I don't want us to be angry at each other. I just wanna be friends with him because of the kids. You know, they deserve to still have their dad in their life and I'm not the type of person that's gonna be like, nope, you can't see your kids. Nope, you can't talk to your kids. No, I'm not that type. Yeah, of course, every couple needs time to cool off and the feelings and the emotions calm down before you can talk to the other person. But um, yeah, me and Omar are no longer together and I don't plan on going back with him. Number one, because it's not the first time that he's left. Mm. I'm just going to be open. Trolls can run with it. I don't care. I'm over it. Moving on. God has blessings for me. Before we got married, um, he had left me for six whole months. Had no contact other than attitude like... Let me talk to my boys type thing. And I'm like, no, not right now because you're still mad. I don't want any manipulation. I'm not going to manip manipulate the kids to feel a certain way. The boys were hurt that he had left. Mm. So he was gone for six months. He went, he was at his mom's. He came back, asked if we can give it a try again, I said yes, because I mean, we have years in this relationship. We got back together and then we tied the knot legally. And this time around, um, I guess he wasn't happy. He told me from his words where he was not happy. 
And I said, that's fine. Um, he also said that he had a fake smile. Like, every, like the whole thing was fake. And I feel like I was being used for something. Which I'm not gonna man, I'm not gonna mention, but I feel like I was being used because how are you gonna tell somebody it was fake or you had to put on a fake smile? That's not fair because I don't I'm not fake. I do everything how I feel. I say what I need to say. Mm. So going through that, mm. but I'm glad it happened now because. God knows how much I prayed to have another baby. Which I was understandable because he's sick. You know, I didn't want to pressure him. I never tried to make him feel bad. But I feel like God knows when and where to do things, right? Oh, so, oh yes. So that's the sad part. We're over with the sad. Moving on. I'm just going to try to find myself, um, be a better person for my boys. On a better note, me and the boys will be having a new place really soon. I already got approved for a place. For me and the boys, it's going to be different because um, it's going to be without him. It's something we've always talked about as a family, but it's okay. Everything happens for a reason, right? That's life. And the way you handle things is what makes you, you know. Mm. So, yeah, I got a place. And I want to thank you guys for all your prayers. Everybody that reached out to me. I'm sorry I couldn't say nothing sooner, but I couldn't talk about it without breaking down. Hi, Walter. It was a very emotional time for me. I'm still a little sensitive about it, but I know talking about it will help me move on. Thank you, Tanya. <laughs> Warden will be going with me. Yes. I swear, I thank God so much that I have my grandma. Thank God. My grandma is, es cabroncita, but who is it? My grandma is a very strong, I have like this block on me that prevents me from doing things on my own. For example, my grandma pushed me to go to college. I didn't make that decision on my own. But yeah, my grandma is like, nah, uh Shake it off, and you're going to continue because your boys need you. <clears throat> and, yeah, those are the two major updates I wanted to share with you guys. Over food, of course. Hi, Jules. Hi, Kane. Hi, Amethyst. I'm sorry if I missed you. Um, missed your guys' message. Hi, my Andrea. Really? Really? First thing me and him talked about, I was going to speak how I felt, and guess who's up in here? Oh, my God. Yeah. I just feel like I get to say my side. He told me how he felt. Bye, Omar. Cute story. Why are you lurking? Move on, buddy. You didn't want to be here with me. It's okay. I accept it, and I'm moving on. The kids are here. No, I know. I'm not bashing him. I'm, he just said cute story. That's my side of the story. Those were words that came from his mouth. And I'm moving on to better and bigger things with or without him. <sighs> I 
Angie. Hi, my beautiful V. Happy birthday. It's your birthday. You can party if you want to. I know, Juanita. Like, I, I'm barely, like, able to talk about it. Like, don't bash me. I'm not bashing you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let him I just ordered me some something. I didn't get to say it. Can you guys all wish V a very happy... Oh, it's not till Saturday? That's okay. Well, I don't know if I'm going to be on Saturday. So everybody, anyways, wish V a happy birthday. Thank you, Mandy. Hi, Britt. Hi, Pilar. Hi, Holly. Happy early birthday, V. I hope you have an amazing birthday. I really, really do. Oh, look at all them birthday wishes. Aww. So how you know it was him? Because I know how he talks. Hi, Nina. Hi, clown girl. If you should lose me, oh, yeah. You lose a good thing. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Cooking with Leslie, said, we love you, Irene. Thank you, Jose. Oh, Walter, you're good. I was just saying that uh, me and Omar are no longer together. I'll leave the live up. Um, I backed my story. That's how I feel. I'm not saying lies. I feel like I was used. Especially if it was 14 years. Playing a song for you. Irene, I'm single again by Trina. I've never heard that one, sweet Liz. Oh my god, we got 500 people in here. Oh my goodness, get sloppy. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you guys for being here. This weekend we should do our chiles. Oh. Oh yeah. Thank you, Kenna. And that's exactly before I wasn't able to talk about it without getting choked up. Like wanting to like cry and get emotional. But I feel like, okay, after this stress, I feel like it's starting to lift off my shoulders and I can speak. Your prayers help. Thank you. I've been praying about it to take negative feelings and thoughts. I just want positivity. I want to be a better person for my kids. Dang, this chat is going by fast. How? Let me see. It helps having to speak about it. <coughs> Get it off your chest. Yes, it does. <coughs> it does with it, but with this platform, it's hard. It's really hard because I was like, no, I'm not ready to for people to. To mess up, me say mean things about that. Because, man. Five hundred and thirty-one people. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Oh, my yes. gosh, y'all. Thank you for all the love. Please hit the like button, please. Ugh. No, the person that was trolling us before, my, he, his family is not like that. They would not troll me. V! Oh, my gosh. Aww. Thank you, everyone, for the early birthday wishes. Love you all. Irene, you got this, Mama. All the best to you. Thank you for that twenty-seven ninety-nine super chat. Thank you, V. Sorry, my stand's a little wobbly. I was trying to get back to a... Uh, I missed the comment. Oh, well. 
Hey, let's make some agua chiles this weekend. Ooh. I would have to go buy the stuff. I don't have nothing to make. Oh, I have shrimp in the freezer. You're an awesome person. Thank you so much, Nikki. You got to read it for me. They're going so fast. And we said, but you have so much support and we love you and can't wait to see you thrive. This is your moment. Aw, thank you. Hola, mi tia Denise. Somebody said, please read. Uh, can you read Ashley's message, mom? I lost my glasses, Mika. I can't read yes, I'm single, Julie. Well, not yet. I'm still legally married, but separated. I, I can't read it because I don't have my glasses. I lost them. Oh, can I borrow? You lost your glasses? Yes. Can I borrow your phone? Yes. I lost both of my glasses behind. Yeah, Gussie, I don't want to bash him in any way. I'm just saying. No, because the kids it was, are. It here. was his choice, and I told my kids, I was upfront about it. I let him know, let the boys know that no matter what, that's still their dad. They still have to love and respect him. Well, and We'll um, make a secret video, and then we'll bash him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing. Oh my God, Grandma, I can't. Shout out to Jesus' wife. <laughs> okay, hold on, Ashley. I'm barely getting my nana's phone. Mm. Oh, but you're not gonna eat this no more, baby. I bet. Uh, drink. I don't Some see him. I'm still drinking it. Oh, okay, I'll leave it here. <laughs> Ashley, honestly, it got lost. Oh, mom, you're not even on live chat. That's why. Que Dios lo bendiga y que se vaya por la sombrita. <laughs> so many fish in the sea. I agree. I agree. Um, there was uh, not a lot going on between both of us. I can say um, I wasn't perfect. He wasn't perfect. We both lacked in the relationship. Um, but it's okay that we can move on from that. He's still going to be my kid's dad, and I'm not going to tell my kids otherwise. I don't know how to do that, Jules. I do not know how to put it on swell mom. Thank you, Gussie. Ay, ya no lo miré, Ashley. I'm sorry. Se perdió la mensaje. But yes, I don't want to. I'm not saying I'm looking for anything right now. Not at all. I just want to um, settle in in my new place. I will not be giving a house tour, though. But when I'm in my place, I'll let you guys know. Um, I did get approved for it, so I am waiting on that. Thank God. Thanks to everybody that has sent prayers and that has supported my channel. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you, Jules. Sherry Berry, yes, my Nana does have my back. And she told me, um, I just bit my lip. That's what I get. She told me, I'm not leaving you alone, mija. No, Melissa, I didn't get no chicken wings. I seen them, though. Thank you. Thank you, V. Mm. Yep, I agree, Anna. Thank you. <laughs> Walter said, unfortunately... <laughs> Walter, I did not feel like laughing, I swear. He said, unfortunately, all the fish in my sea were all barracudas. <laughs> Aren't those, those ugly long ones with the big mouth? No, those are eels, huh? Barracudas. Oh, my gosh, Walter. Yeah, Brooke, I agree. I, I would never turn my kids against him. I did tell him, give me time to cool off because... 
you know, when you first go through that, you're emotional and, and, they hurt you. and you feel hurt and stuff like that. And Irene, I would love to gift you a new housewarming gift. You should do an Amazon wish list or let us know anything you'd like. Let me move into my place first and because I do have quite a bit of stuff that my ex-mother-in-law has been gifting me from Princess House. So I still have all that stuff. Um, let me see what I need and I will do that. Thank you. Oh, uh, thank you, Mandy. Uh, Marie, I agree. Every ending is a new beginning for better things. Yep. Thank you, Sherry Berry. I'm so... Actually, I have, um, I have Instagram and I have... TikTok and I have Snapchats and all of them are under La Gordi Seats. Uh, thank you, Lu uh, Lu Yuli. Sorry, I mispronounced that. Be there, better person, Irene. It will bring you peace. Yeah, uh, I know the first time around, it it was really hard and I was trying to, I was holding a grudge, but this time around, I asked God to guide me on how how to handle this situation and i just want to be the bigger better person i don't want to keep my boys from him they'll be able to see him um when they're ready too i'm not gonna force it on them it's when they're ready because of course it hurts them also oh hi mama appetite she said, hi, Miha, you're a strong woman. Keep it up. What did you eat, Miha? We just had a rebus. Yeah, I got Taco Bell. I got the grilled cheese burrito, and I ordered a chalupa. They forgot my chalupa, and I ordered a Doritos taco, and they forgot my Doritos taco. <laughs> so basically, I had a um, burrito and some nachos. Can you believe that? Eddie Marie, um, they haven't said anything to me. Um, that day I called his mom and we spoke, but we haven't spoken since then. Um, but they haven't said nothing bad to me or tried to bash me or anything. So they're good people. Yeah, yeah they're good. They're good people. They're not, um, gonna call me talking smack or anything like that. Mom is good person. His mom has always liked me, loved me. I love them too. It's just, um, we need our space from each other right now. Um, 15 years is a long time. So we just got to get used to not being around him, but it's okay. It is what it is. That's life. I wish him the best. Hi, Mugbang Mari. How are you, beautiful? Oh, hi, beautiful. I still love Stephanie. Oh, yeah, hi. your niece. niece. Mm -hmm. hi, hi, Prima. I'm so glad my tia is going with you. You guys need each other. Oh, thank you. Oh, I, I need her so much. She does so much for me, prima. Hi, Connie from Bigger Appetites channel. Welcome. Will y'all share custody or did y'all get off on good terms? I don't want to do anything custody because who is custody really for? Is it really for the kids or is it for the parents? I believe it's for the parents. So, no, I'm not doing all that. Um... He wants to take if he wants to take the boys later on in the future, not right now, because we have to build not trust, but um, he got, he, I don't know. He got to show initiative. I don't know if that's the right word, but later on, um, like I said, he can talk to the boys right now, just not without me because. I don't want him to manipulate them. I'm not going to manipulate them. Oh, my God. We, we got 600 people in here. What? Oh, I get suave. 
I want to leave my IG because I feel like you need a friend, but all the mess, I'm afraid to. Then don't leave it in here. Just find me on Instagram and send me a personal message. Ask anybody. I always answer my messages. You got a refund? No, but I'm about to tomorrow. Shoot. Uh -huh. <clears throat> yes, yo, Maida, my grandma is going with me to the new place. I've never been alone. I've always lived with people, so... Hey, A.V., thank you for that $25... Thank you for that $25 super chat. That was a mouthful. Oh, <laughs> uh, thank you. Hello, gorgeous. I've been seeing you and the family. Hello, beautiful warden. <clears throat> Hello. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have a little bit of a cough. Arizona weather is freaking crazy. During the day, you're out in the sun and it's hot. You're burning your skin. You step in the shade, it feels like you went from 100 degrees to, to 25 degree weather. You're going to make some Yeah, I'm still hungry, mama. <laughs> I didn't want to say, but I, that burrito and nachos wasn't doing it. Let me know. I inboxed the real you i did get two notifications that said wants to send you a message so after the live i'll check them hi ben hi extina more grubs for the subs i love your little intros and shh ASMR. i love it okay we'll what you want beef or chicken um beef mama beef just be beer. really really careful with not having anything legally in place especially when another country could be involved oh yeah she's right um mm -hmm. you want this one the chili trip oh i don't like the no. seasoning on that one just the beef, beef if there's beef. no beef i'll do chicken it's yeah, fine there's beef. <laughs> careful christopher puppy your backpack Thank you, Molly. I'm excited for your new beginnings and hope you, the boys, and Mama Word and have many blessings this year. Thank you. It's been off to a rough start, but I'm praying to God that the, um, everything falls into place all in his timing. Thank you, Yin Zai. I do have plans, Eddie Marie. I... I I don't want to speak on them yet because I don't want the uh, one that lies to destroy any plans that I have. So I'm going to just keep it in prayer since that one can't listen to your prayers. I think I have to reboot because I'm not getting a good connection. Oh, really, Walter? Or go to your settings and see if you're on the highest one. My Nana's is on 144. What, Ma? You want uh, jalapeno? A couple of slices? Yeah, Mommy, please. Boiled in the water. All right. Dang, 620 people? Oh, my goodness. Que suave. Will the warden join you in the new house? Yes, yo, my da. Um, Yeah, you go, girl. I'm so proud of you. I'm waiting for my... um. My degree in the mail. That that's what I'm waiting for. But your girl already updated her resume. Um I'm, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I can't hear, but Irene, I'm here for you if you ever need to talk. It might be weird to you because you don't know me personally, but I feel like I know you and you're a friend. You oh. know where to find me. Thank you, my beautiful Jen. Oh my god, Jen. Damn, what's word you making? Just the raw noodles because talk about them for half my order. <laughs> yep, that's exactly why Olivia. Hi, Wallabus. I don't know where to make merch, Natasha. Thank you, Andrea. Hey, I'm just getting the live. I was scrolling through and seeing you. How are you doing? Hope everything's fine. I hope everybody's in the best of health. God bless you and your family. Thank you, Wallabus. 
<coughs> we're doing okay other than this dumb cold front that we have. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Stephanie said, I can see that cousin. When I go out there in March, I'm taking you out to have fun karaoke. Oh. Oh, yeah, that'll be fun. I am so down. Hi, Jacqueline. Thank you, Monica. Thank you, Rose. Natasha, the thing is, um, that company reached out to my cousin for his merch. So they have to reach out to the creators to even want to do like um, a collab kind of thing. I I agree, Papa Senama. Everything happens for a reason. And I don't wish him bad at all. I really do hope he finds happiness. And, and I hope we can be good friends for the boy's sake. But, Irene, we got to get you a boyfriend. <laughs> As the... <laughs> my grandma oh time for some drinks and charlie's de la bread oh my ah, gosh bread let's go now <laughs> it's been freezing these past oh. days even got a little snow down here in buckeye az it's been cold i swear Arizonans don't even know how to turn on our heater tell me why we've been turning on our heater every day Yes, LL. It was his decision to separate. Forget the boyfriend, girl. You need a sugar daddy, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Warden, hola, mi café. Dice la Pamela. Hola, hola, Pamela, mica. ¿Cómo estás? Hazel Eyes, thank you. I'm so excited to move into my place. Um, the boys, thank God, will have their own room. I swear, I can't wait to see how they look in their own beds. They're about to be teenagers. They need their privacy. Congrats on the new place. I'm so happy for you and the boys. You got this. It won't be easy, but you will feel better once yeah. the healing and sadness subsides. Thank you, Hazel Eyes. I appreciate that. Hi, Selena. Thank you. <laughs> Big Mike said, love you, go to these. If you're ever in Houston, we're going on a date. Yeah. Sure, you better get ready to pay for a good buffet, buddy. Because <laughs> <laughs> your girl can eat. <laughs> um, I love to make handmade shirts. Oh, that's cool. Aww. Thank you, Lisa Hamilton. I appreciate that. Girl, my heater has been on and set at 74 every day. Britt, we've had it on 77, girl. Like, it's been freezing where I'm a polar bear. I sleep with my fan on in the winter. And I have it on low because, you know, it gets stuffy. But that heater's been on. Is 70 cold for y'all? No, Jose. It's been uh like 40 degrees here. 40 and then overnight it's like in the 30s on my hex to the no it's been really cold mm -hmm. well they said we were it was gonna freeze tonight yeah we had we had a freeze warning yesterday and um a freeze warning tonight huh mama oh yeah. we should get your uh your aloe vera in oh no no that's enough wait you and your husband are divorced now i'm sorry no we're not legally divorced yet I'm separated, and yes, we're separated. Um, but the way I feel, last time I gave him another chance, he gave me another chance, whatever. But this time, I don't want to. Like, I don't want to force somebody into a relationship. I want them to be in the relationship because they want to. Not because they're comfortable or used to me, no. I want them to be in a relationship because they want to love me and show me affection. Thank you, Maria. I appreciate that. Please, guys, make sure to hit the like button. 
We got 632 people up in here. Oh, oh my gosh. Love it. Um, Kaylee Page, there's no set date yet. All I know is my application got approved and I am on the wait list. So, Pretty oh, sweet. thank you, Ma. What what are those seeds or chitapin? Ch no, they're uh crushed chilies. Ah, uh, okay. Lots of lemon. Yes. Just the way mm -hmm. you like it, Mhm. Mm you do it, Baba. I do. You got. Oh, what did Walter say? You got a new place. When did you get the new place? Walter, I just heard back to uh, today that I got approved. Um, I don't have a move-in date yet. Um, so, yeah. I know that's right, girl, because I'm not one of them girls you take out about a salad. You got to feed me. How much? 34-course meal kind of girl. Hey. <laughs> that's funny. Oh, my God. <laughs> I was in the same situation nine years and tell me I love you. Oh. Loved you the first year, but stayed because you took care of everything. Yeah. Melissa said, my husband is for sale. Free to a good home. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Free to a good home. Oh, my goodness. He lost a great woman. Whatever his unhappiness was, I'd like to say you were there to always understand him. And if his kids were not his happiness, nothing will be happiness. Exactly. Well said, Alicia. Oh, I'll put some right now, Mama. Yeah, Um, Susie, yes, I will be keeping the live up because I wanted to share that with you guys. And uh, I'm sorry if I've stressed anybody out with my issue, but I like to be open. Um, but one thing I ain't disclosing is where I live. Because, no. I just wanted to update you guys because you guys knew what I was going through. So, I feel like you guys deserve to know. Thank you, Brit. I appreciate you, love. <laughs> I hate when the pasta is overcooked and it's soft. I like the crunch, though. You like it. Oh. Really, Asusena? We will pay for the food, okay? <laughs> Ding dong. <laughs> Good day from the Midwest. Love your content. Thank you, Charles. Appreciate you. Chiflada Irene. <laughs> Well, yeah, I ordered me a whole meal deal from Taco Bell, and they forgot half my order. So, girl, the gas went up. My gas bill yeah. was so high. My brother's gas bill was triple. Wow. So, look at your gas bill. Try to turn them off and wear some cozy, cozy clothes. Yes. Um. We don't pay for gas. Um, just electricity. Um, in my new apartment, I don't pay for, I'm not going to be paying for gas. I believe it's just electricity and rent. Yeah. But I can do it. I'm going to put my all into it. Um, and I am looking for a, another income to, to help cover that. But I got, I got it. I know God got me. My grandma got me. Then you have your I'm not going to be discouraged. Huh? You have your people, mija, that watch you. Talk. Yeah, mama, I know. I was nervous. And I was like, okay. But it's, it's going to be, it was going to be the same thing with or without whoever. Really, the doors? LL, at first, they were really sad, but um, they were crying. I'm, I'm the type of person that likes to be straight up with my kids. Like, I don't want to have lies between us, especially because they're going to be teenagers. I want them to be able to trust me to tell me their things. So I told them 
without being biased and saying my feelings, I told them um, the situation and they were a little bit sad or whatever. And I told them, like, I don't care what disagreements you, me and your dad have. You guys are not the cause of our disagreements. You got to always love and respect them. So. My cousin said, when you are ready, you will find someone great. You are beautiful and have a kind heart. Thank you so much, cousin. Who's that? Stephanie. The universe has your back. You're a lucky woman, and everything will work out for you. You have your family support as well. All of us here, we want nothing but the best for you and your boys. Oh, thank you, my Brit. <sighs> it's a little stressful, but I got to move on. I, I can't keep letting the stress get to me. Like, no lie, my grandma bought the boys wing stock. I got wing stock and a salad. I ate two wings. Y'all know I can tear it up. And yeah, I read it beautiful. Thank you. Y'all know I could tear it up. No lie. I ate two or three wings, a little bit of salad, and I couldn't eat no more. My stomach was so twisted. But today I had an appetite that I want to talk about. <laughs> Thank you, Lisa. Mm. And I told them, too. Like, I asked them. I said, don't be afraid to tell me how you feel about it. Whether it's um, how you feel that I'm doing something wrong or whatever. Just talk to me. Because I want us to have that relationship. Especially when they're teenagers. Because everybody knows how teenagers can be. I want them to be open with me. And me with them. What, Walter? Oh, Lord. He said, my gas bill three months ago was 40 bucks. I just got my gas bill last week. It's 376 Can I dig? Oh, my goodness. Big Mike said, can I request some prayers for my grandma? She lost her house in the tornado that hit here. Oh, no. Oh, yes, we'll pray. Big Mike, I pray that everything works out. Oh, my gosh. I swear I would, I would never... Could never live where there's tornadoes. That is, like, the most scariest thing to me. Like, I I don't know how people do it to live where there's tornadoes. That's scary. Mm. My thoughts and prayers are with you guys. And I pray that everything, that, um, everything works out for you guys. And I, ho I hope everybody was safe. Um, cause I know those could be very bad. So I hope everybody was safe and I'm sorry that you guys are going through that. Thank you, Rose. Hi, Diane. How are you? Beautiful. Family Irene will get you through this and God. Yep. I agree. Philip, I've been praying a lot about it. A lot, a lot, a lot. Sorry. That's why I live in AZ. The only thing we get is the hot, hot temperatures. Yep. But then in that case, there's uh, AC and fans and swimming pools. Like, heck, so no. Probably neighbors. Oh, really? Yeah. Big Mike said it's rare that it happens there. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Stardust. How are you? Why is everyone... That might be... Mm. Not us, Tracy. Um, I've always been a type of person that as I'm going somewhere, I'm turning off all the lights. Like, uh-uh. I don't play that. Be quiet, peanut. 
Leave her. Yup, yeah, V, that was Peanut. Hi, Summer. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh, Walter, don't burn your kitchen down. <laughs> he said, I have to go. I'm sorry, I have to leave. I'm having a cooking disaster. Oh my oh, Lord. Oh my goodness. Hi, Leisha. <clears throat> Girl, I love Peter Piper pizza. Where is your bowl? Here. Probably okay. under the couch. Oh yes, no, it's right here. Come on, here. Get some food. Come on. Perfect. Thank you, Sammy. I definitely will not lose my faith in God. Perfect. Come on. Will you be able to take your fur babies with you? I'm going to have to. They belong to my son. Ooh, he doesn't PJ need... is Christians. Hermione, is... Hermione and uh, Mello are his. Says more, more cats. Um, yeah, Tasha, we still have the puppy. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's a crybaby, though. Come I here. swear. Come here, come on, yeah, right there. You're such a beautiful soul, Irene. Wishing nothing but the best for you and your family. Thank you, Sochi. <sighs> mm hmm. Oh my gosh. Is that a cat or a dog? Mandy, I have both. I have three cats and one puppy. Ashley, hi, beautiful. I will be keeping the live up, hon. Oh. Hi, Christina. Hi, Gladys. I've never put eggs in this. Just, we like to dress it up with chile, lemon, cilantro, onion. My fettuccine Alfredo is not Alfredo enough. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thank you, Kathy. Sassy Ruby, I got three animals. Well, we had one no we've had many but i ain't gonna lie they gots to go if they start destroying property I went to price. because i ain't trying to be paying hundreds and hundreds of dollars for damage they do heck no have you told the story of how, how we got pj mm. please 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 we need another country boys breakfast video oh, oh yeah. I haven't been to Country Boys in so long. And they really changed. I love them. Mm -hmm. Get back here, Noodle. Oh, it's gone. Yeah, we used to go there all the time, but they changed a lot of things. So that's why we stopped going. I miss my dogs being tiny and playful. Now all they do is sleep and eat. Girl, that's all I want this dog to do. It <laughs> cries for me. He he just wants to sleep with me. I'm like, heck no. Because, okay, number one, he's not potty trained. So him sleeping with me, he can roam around and do the potty. All, I ain't waking up, stepping on nothing. Heck no. Plus, he already peed on me. Oh, he peed on Christopher's pants. Mm-mm. Yeah, it totally was not me. I'm kidding. It was hard-boiled egg or scrambled egg. Oh, I don't know. I like boiled eggs. Oh, hi, cousin. La berries, my the la berries. Aww. Um, I had Taco Bell, cousin, but unfortunately, they forgot half my order, so Nana made me a maruchan because I was not trying to drive back in traffic. Heads to the gnome. Have you ever tried the Shin Ramen Black Noodles? They are really good. A little spicy, but not too bad. Really? The Shin 
Raymond. I don't think I've had those. I've tried. I've tried a lot of um different Asian noodles, but I don't think that specific brand. Sorry. I've tried. Okay, now I'm full. Whew. Six hundred and twenty-seven, wow. and we got three hundred and five likes. Oh it's my gosh! Fine. I know, Gladys. I'm full. I just left a tiny bit. Bueno, para que no estén diciendo ay, okay? You better make her agua chile. Mmm. Oh, Pamela, I'm sorry you're going through it too, my beautiful. Aww. Be strong and try not to, I, I don't know, my advice is try not to hold a grudge. Just let them go. If it's meant to be, it's meant to be. And if it's not, let it go. Shin Ramen Black Pack is bomb. Really, Sarah? Oh, heck no. I'm going to have to go get me some. We'll check that line behind. Mm-hmm. Yes. Whew. V wants to hear your guess suave. There's 615 people in here, Ma. Guess suave. <laughs> Now for something sweet. Mm, I don't think I have anything sweet. No compramos nada, mija. Except for the sugar-free masa pans that Martha sent you. Oh, yeah. Can I have one? I don't know where they are. Uh -huh, you don't know where they're at. <laughs> she sent you two boxes. I know. Martha, if you're in the chat, thank you for the sugar-free masa pan. All the way from Mexico, eh? Oh, uh -huh. Oh, aquí están. You knew where they were. Look at Grandma not trying to share. Uh -huh. I couldn't find them, hombre. I've been craving the ube cheesecake. Oh, my gosh. Why you got to say that? I love Filipino food. Un masapan. Oh, ahí está la Marta, mama. Oh, ahí está Marta. Thank you, mija. I think that's it. It's, she said it's. Oh, yep. You're very welcome, hermosas. Yes. Uh-huh. Exactly. Just, Cindy, hand over the box, Nana. No. Let me see. How many do you have in that box? Just two. Let me see. <laughs> Let me see. Damn, Oh, so she finished the first box, and she's already working on no, the second one. I haven't finished the first Where's box. Where's the first box? It's over there on the top. Oh, Let me see. Bring it. No, it's on the top. Leave it there. I can't with you. <laughs> From the the first box, I had two. From this box, one. I can't with her. Yeah. Be quiet, Gordy. <laughs> I'm putting you on blast. Uh huh. Not sharing her candy, Mira. I can't with you, Ma. I absolutely love that you're so strong and mentally prepared for anything. I love, love, love that you don't talk down on their dad, but help them understand what's going on instead of leaving. Oh, thank you, Kayla. I went through a lot of trauma as a kid with my parents. And growing up, I always told myself I would never be like that. You learn, you learn from what you go through. But my mom didn't have to talk down. We saw, I saw everything, and I don't want my kids to see anything. Not that he, I'm not gonna lie. Omar has never put his hands on me or nothing like that. It's just lack of affection. Martha said, "Okay, it's okay, Grandma. I'll bring you more." <laughs> And to be honest, I wasn't mentally prepared for it. I thought things were just fine. Mm. 
There was a lot of lack of communication on both parts, but and it took me a while. I couldn't tell you guys right off the bat because every time I would bring up or think of the name, I'd get sad and choked up, but it's okay. No, I would pay for them. I just don't like eating them by myself. They don't taste the same. Cynthia, I don't really talk about her a lot. She's around, but she does. She's doing her own thing. Yes, I love the masa pans covered in chocolate. Those are good. Gladys said, I'm eating flan with you. Ooh, girl. Ooh. That sounds so good. Have y'all tried the chocolate? Oh, yep. I, I did. No, it's okay, Cynthia. I know there's a lot of new viewers. Um, I don't talk about my mom or any trauma that I've been through because I feel... That's personal and not even my kids uh, or ex-husband knows everything. Out of, out of mind, out of sight. If I don't think about it, it didn't happen. <laughs> That's what I taught myself. To get through it. Mm. Hi, Isabel. Yes, I will be leaving the live up. Hi, just logged in. Yeah, yes, and yeah, that's exactly what I was talking about. Hi, Vanessa. Mmm, making homemade burgers and fries. Oh, that's what we forgot, Christopher. Mmm. Mm. Our hot dog challenge that me and you had said when we did a live. A live. Okay, now I know for the next time. Will he be paying child support to help with the boys? I know it can be hard having teens. No. I, I'm not going to charge him child support because, number one, he's sick. And um, the little bit that he used to work um, painting with um, someone, it wasn't like a big income. So I really want... Him to use that towards himself and um, and towards um, like his medical or whatever. I don't want to take money from them. I can do it on my own. Um, if I struggle, I struggle, but I don't want to ask anybody for money. Not them. I'm not going to lie. They have helped us in the past, but that's when we were together. I don't know how they feel about it now that we're split up. But, oy. it's sad, but everything one goes through makes us stronger. I agree, Marta. Uh, Crystal, thank you for showing some love. Oh, wow, Diane, that's amazing. Went through the same thing, so I finally left home at 13, got a job, finished school, and had a house by the time I was 16. Wow. Th that is not sad. I mean, the situation you probably went through was probably sad, Diane, but if you think about it, you accomplished a lot at a young age. Me and middle child enjoy watching you guys. Oh, thank you, Yesenia. Hi, you know, spider. Thank you, Genesis. I did not fall out of love, though. That's the thing. I love him. I loved him. Nothing about it was fake on my behalf. But, I mean, if he didn't love me no more, then, I mean, what can I do? I'm not going to force him to be with me. I don't want to force anybody. And that's not love right there. You can't force somebody to love you. Hmm.
Susana, it wasn't, but I'm doing better now. Oh my God, Irene, those hot dogs again. Yes, please do a video eating them. No, V, in my last life that I was with uh, Christopher, he he ate a, like a chicken sandwich and I ate, um, I think it was shrimp, like um, shrimp cocktail. And we did the um, chamoy pickle. So me and him, I forgot. We challenged each other to see who could eat the most. No, three hot dogs in the least amount of time. So if he wins, I give him $50, I think we agreed on. And if I win, he has to massage my feet every day for one week for 30 minutes each day. Oh, no, he's not. But I'm not going to make him do the seven. I said five days is okay. Yeah. Uh -huh, that's right. Uh-huh. Mmm, Nephi B. That sounds good. Or Nephi B, I'm sorry. Thank you, Mariel. Oh, I'm so sorry, Christina. You can do bad all by yourself or good. Sorry, song came up in my head. Yep, I know exactly. I love that movie. Oh, my gosh. No, uh, Mina Fitness, this is for real. Um, it's not the first time. Um, before we got married two years ago, um, he left me for six months, me and the boys. Um... I gave him a second chance. Um, he asked for us to try to make it work again. I thought we were happy, and then he just hit me with, nope. So, Irene, from what I've seen in you, you're a very strong woman, plus you have God as your main supporter. Thank you, Isabel. Thank you so much. May I ask who you are talking about? Gladys, I'm talking about my husband. Después lamentará las cosas, quedará regresar y será des demasiado tarde entonces. Ah, dale. Ya, yeah, porque cuando una persona le da todo y sí, sí lo ama y lo quiere y todo, pues cuando desprecian a uno se siente feo, pero ni modo, ¿qué voy a hacer, no? Yes, for massage is the best. But E97, I can't obligate him to help with the boys when I know he doesn't work every day because he does dialysis. I don't want to put that. If he wants to come in and say, hey, here goes some money for the boys. Okay, of course, I'm going to accept it. But I'm not going to be like, nah, you owe me child support. This, 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 this and much. No. Because I know he's not 100 and I don't want to. Stress him like that. I don't want to be the reason for him getting even more sick or nothing like that. I wish him all the best. And yeah. Six months. Yeah. Six months. Oh my gosh, Yvonne. I'm through the same thing. 20 plus years we got this. Wow. Oh 20 years. Thank you, Jennifer. Yup. Yes. I, I. Now that you said it that way, there's been more blessings than stresses. My driver's license, got a car, got my college degree, new apartment coming soon. I, I'm very grateful to God. Like, no lie. You don't have to say it. Your mother is no I know. I... Oh. Let's go speed dating, Irene. Bring Grandma Wardy with you, right? She ain't going to sit at no table unless they got a cowboy hat. Uh -huh. Oh, my gosh. My cheeks are so red. It's been cold. What'd you eat, Cousin Aries? Some people need to follow you as an example. When people are no longer together with kids, stay humble. It wasn't easy, Brooke, but I think with maturity. I know I act immature sometimes, but I don't want to be immature anymore. My parents got divorced when I was five, and it was so traumatic because they both hated each other. 
and it was so toxic. I bet. I hear so many stories that that affects the kids. I don't want this to affect my kids. It was just out of the blue summer. Out of the blue. Out of the blue, like last time. Last time I, I got a. I don't love you anymore. I'm. I'm gone. That's what I got last time. This time it was at least. It was a little bit more. I'm not happy. I don't feel like me and you are husband and wife. I've been putting a fake smile. And I've been putting a fake smile. I said, okay, go ahead. Yeah, last time and this time, but it's okay. I truly just want to give you a hug and pray that you heal so quickly. Thank you, Kayla. I was craving something greasy, burger and chili fries. Oh my gosh, that sounds so good, cuz. Thank you, Stacy. Um, Birdie, I'll go ahead and leave the live up so you guys can check it out. I can't make him want to be with me anymore. I was raised to do everything and anything for my spouse, but we and I can do so much. Yep. I mean, I was married to my ex for 20 years, and what split us up was the communication and the affection. I That's, that's a big issue right there. Yep. I thought we had great communication, but I guess... Not nah, especially when the other person's putting a fake smile. The what kind of communication can there be? I have remarried a wonderful man seven years ago. Within time, you'll find that true love you deserve. Thank you, Isabel. She sure will. Thank you so much. <laughs> uh, Susana, me and him in um, April would have been 15 years. 15 years minus the six months that he went to his mom. But it's okay. We all move on. Oh, my God, Valerie. Okay, so I went to do laundry yesterday because the boys had no clean clothes. And I was listening to so I was like, who the hell is seeing this? So I shazammed it. And I seen it was Miley. I was all putting it on full blast. But with all the stress, I swear... I swear, I was like, okay, don't forget your purse. Don't forget your keys. And I ended up forgetting a load in the dang dryer. So I had just got back home after picking up a few things from the store from my grandma. And I had to go back. And I was like, oh, my gosh, I can't. The way he's so comfortable just to say that hurts, hurts to the core. Yeah. Yep. Yep, Vanessa, my grandma's going with me um, to my new place. I can't wait. God has something better. Yep, I appreciate that. Jason, I don't care what he was feeling. That's no reason to leave your family. He's done it before, and I'm not going to. Put up with with it. I deserve better than that. He deserves better than that. If he was feeling a certain way, he could have talked to me as a couple. Um, but when somebody tells you, I don't love you anymore. Um, I've been having, I've been really having to put a fake smile. Um, that kind of stuff hurts. That hurts. Like, how am I supposed to feel? Okay, he's expressing his feelings. But am I supposed to say, oh, okay, you know, um, I don't know. I don't know what I was supposed to feel or think. I just said, okay, I, I release you. I'm releasing him to do whatever the heck he wants. <sighs> oh, my gosh. Almost 700 people in here. What? You seem like you love so passionate. And with all you have, I know the love you give out will return to you in tenfold. Yep. May the people around be honest and transparent, full of love. And see, yep. that's my biggest weakness right there. I'm, I, Come on. I am too upfront. I'm too forward. Um, I speak how I feel. I don't beat around the bush. 
people take it as being a B, but I I never take it that way. I like to be up front with everybody and anybody. Why are you gonna be gossiping in back of people? Yeah. Dang, I'm going on 12 with Manny. Better leave me now if he's planning to. Right, Aries? Shoot. <laughs> leave my Manny alone. Thank you, Christina. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you, Shayna. Hello, Irene. I just got in the live. Thank you, um, Bonds Life. I will definitely be leaving the live up if you guys want to um, go, back, to go back and see what I was talking about. Lifting you and the boys up in prayers and sending you guys love and aloha. Thank, Thank you. you. My ass said cleaning, but I'm listening. Oh, heck no. Don't even talk about cleaning up in here, girl. I am done cleaning. You can be happy without a partner, Irene. If you meet someone, then he can compliment your life, not complicate it. Yep. Exactly. Yep. I, I felt more like he's right. He said, I feel like me and you are not husband and wife. I agree 100%. I felt like, I'm just going to say, I felt like your nurse, your babysitter, your provider, like... Yeah. Thank you, happy one, two, three, four. I wish you all the best. My parents divorced after 25 years, and my mom is wow. happier that way. And we, the children, are also happy. Being in a toxic relationship hurts more than let loose. But see, that's the thing. I don't feel like we were toxic. We never... We had our disagreements, but it's never been a shouting match. It's never been physical, like... No cussing. He, no cussing. We don't cuss at each other. He res He's always respected me. I've always respected him. Okay, sometimes I have attitudes, but what woman don't, right? He's had his days with attitudes, and, like, that's all it was. But it wasn't more than that, and I'm so glad. You know, I'm so glad that it wasn't bad. He just didn't love you anymore. Yep, my grandma sure is moving with me. I ain't leaving her behind. <laughs> no. <laughs> what do you mean, haha? <laughs> no. I can't with you, Grams. Oh, hi, Crystal Marie Eats. How are you, beautiful? Aww. Oh, my gosh. You're terrible. Don't say that kind of stuff. Bad you. <laughs> Naughty. Illegal. <laughs> Can I mukbang that something? Oh, Some people just fall out of love, but I'm sure you both will be friends. Yeah, I, that's the thing, though. I'm hurt because I didn't fall out of love with him. He did me, I guess, but he should have said it from the get-go and not had a fake smile. Like, I was with someone for 18 years, two kids, never thought I would be happy again, but I am now. Girl, you got this, and I'll keep you in my prayers. Thank Aww, you, Sarah. Thank you for your prayers. Irene, remember, you get a chance twice, but a second chance once. Remember, you get a chance twice. Oh. Thank you, Papa and Alma. I'm doing okay. Had to... In my family, back to back, so it's been extremely hard. Oh, I'm so sorry for you. I remember that happened to us. Um, my sister passed away, and then a couple months later, my little cousin passed away. It was very hard on our family, um, especially because you feel like you don't finish grieving the first one. I mean, you never fin finish grieving, but it's like so fresh that it's really hard to accept another so close. another one so close in time so my condolences to you and your family and i lift you up in my prayers and pray that god comforts you guys in this um hard time for you guys crystal <clears throat> excuse me meaning more chances you deserve better than on and off yeah exactly thank you i wasn't understanding that Oh. 
Yeah, that's hard. Um, oh, Malin, holding animosity is very hard. And I think the baby or child don't deserve to see that side of you or him. Because at the end of the day, it's not about us. Once you have kids, it's about your kids' well-being. Hey, exactly. Oh, thank you, endless love. Yep, beauty by beautifulness. Yep, it's just a bump in the road, and I will get through it. God, um, by putting God first. Tell him to say a prayer for us, mommy. Yeah, mama. Won't do us nothing. I have a great friendship after the separation, and it's what's best. And it's definitely a process and a lot of getting used to, for sure. Oh, yeah. Yep. I agree. Thank you, Vanessa. You're welcome, Crystal. Since when did he feel like that? Um, I don't know. Um, I, he, t he, um, a week, maybe a couple days before he, he expressed this to me. He said, um, that he was feeling depressed, um, that because he felt like he couldn't provide for us and stuff like that. And I was like, look, you know, um, he said he felt like crying and stuff like that. So I said, look, I go try to hold it in for a little while because, me and you will talk about it by ourselves. Don't don't show that to the kids. I wanted him to hold it in for a little while just so the kids can go to the room or something so they don't have to see the depressed him because I want them to always think of their dad as good, you know? Me and him can talk about that. And he just kept on, and I was trying to understand him. And he's like, you're not understanding me. And I said, I know. And you're not understanding me. I'm just telling you to chill. Like, we'll talk about it, and at the end of the day, he wanted to drink. He drank his two bottles of wine, I went to bed. A couple of days later, he um, we went outside, and we were talking. He's like, yeah, I just, I don't feel like we're happy. I'm happy. I haven't been happy in a long time, and um, I don't feel like we're husband and wife anymore and stuff like that. So I just said, okay, you know, whatever. I just want to move on. How's the puppy and nails going? Oh, you're talking to Crystal. I'm like, I don't got nails. I bite my nails. <laughs> As you can tell, when I'm nervous or stressed out, I bite my nails. It's a bad habit. I know I always try to break it, but I can't. Good night, Irene and family. Sending positive vibes your way. Many blessings. Feel better, Mama Warden. Thank, Thank you, you, my beautiful Andrea. Lots of love. God bless you. Have a great night. Thank you for joining me. Don't forget to pray for us. Yes. Nana said, if you guys can please say a prayer for us. It's about the kids, but it also, but it's also about you. You are your own person and deserve all the happiness. Yes. You be happy. It in turn, will show your kids that you're okay and they will be happy. Yeah, yes. I agree, D. I agree. But what I meant by um, it's not about us, like, instead of, like, fighting with your ex-spouse, like, just let it go. Just let it go and make the best of what you got. V says she'll keep us in your prayers, Ma. Thank in you, her v. prayers. Thank you, V. Yes, please hit. Oh my God, we got six hundred and seventy people in here. Oh my God, qué suave. Sheesh. Qué suave. Acá estoy de gritona. It's okay, Nana. Oh, Walter's back in here. What did I Walter say? Walter. Okay, disaster resolved. Mission accomplished. Oh Lord, Walter, did you do a taste test or have your brother test it before before you eat it? <laughs> Oh my gosh. I know it hurts now, but you're a very beautiful, humble, and kind soul. And it will take time, but you will do it alone or with someone new. Love yes. and blessings to you. Thank you, Diane. That's the plan. Like, I want to do it alone for now because I feel like I've let my myself go, like, who I am as a person. I've let it go. And, 
you know, it, it's just been, I want to re, re, um, how do you say it? I don't know how to say it. Like become myself again, you know, the happy me. I don't know. I just want to feel better. I'm not going to be looking for nobody or nothing. Not right now. Uh, not right now. Later on in the future when I feel like, okay, you know, things are settled. God put things in his place. If it comes, it comes. But, yeah. <laughs> Walter said, I ate it. I survived. Left all out. That's good to know, Walter. Oh, Lord. Woo. Alicia said, I'm 22. My mom left us when I was 13, and I was never able to look at her. Okay, I forgave, but things never went back yeah. the same. If your kids decide to not see him for now, he has to understand he abandoned them. Yes. Yep, I yes. agree. Thank you, Alicia. I agree. Last time um, around, I know he probably thought I was keeping them from him, but my kids weren't ready to talk to him. And every time he called, every time he called, no. they didn't want to talk to him. So I respected that. I didn't force them to talk to him. Um, but this time I'm like, look, you still got to respect and love them. They already spoke to him on the phone, but it was just about their video game. It wasn't like. Okay. Or are Okay, so what do you guys need for your new place? Or are you folks taking everything from your grandma's place? So, Kayla, um, I have a lot of things in my storage that my ex-mother-in-law used to send me. I have a lot of stuff uh, every Christmas, every birthday. She always gifted me stuff from Princess House. So, I have a lot of my own things already. Um, I don't know... Well, you I know what I yeah. so I'm gonna need to buy furniture, but I don't care. I'm going to the thrift store. I don't care. <laughs> it's my house. I do. I buy from wherever. I'm gonna start off from thrift store stuff, and as it gets easier, if I can afford it later on, I'll do better stuff. But for now, we're just gonna do thrift store stuff. Um, what I do need though, because I can't live without coffee. I'm going to have to buy. I know I'm going to need a coffee maker. Not the percolator. I um. One of those things that you told me you wanted me huh? Oh, I forgot what it's called. Carrick? No. No. Oh, an espresso. I'm going to buy me an espresso machine. Espresso. Almost said. Oh, Anita. Thank you for that $10 super stick sticker, love. Thank, thank you. you, Anita. Oh my god, I feel like I can't say the words. <laughs> You're nervous. Yeah, I think I'm a little bit nervous. This topic is still kind of like hard to talk about, you know? But dang, only eight more people when we got 700. Oh my god. <laughs> Grandma, you're going to have to turn you're going to have to twerk. No. No, Lagordis, take it from me. You have to heal first. Believe me, I was once you you will go on. But Melissa, that's the thing like I'm ready. I'm ready to move on. Like the first time around, I was sad. This time, I'm like, all right, all right. It is what it is. It was. It was I'm not gonna lie. The first week, this whole week, it was. It's been like, I don't want to talk about it. Every time I seen a comment, like, where's Omar? I'm like, oh my gosh. Like, I don't want to blow up. Like, I felt like I was gonna blow up every time I seen the comment. But it's not because of you guys asking. It's just. You've been crying. I've been trying to hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, and not share it. But, girl, yeah, girl's ready to move on. On to bigger and better things with or without you, buddy. I will keep y'all in my prayers. And if you don't care, please keep me and my kids in your prayers because yes. we are going through something right now. And I honestly am at my breaking point. I have cried all day. Stacy, oh, yeah. keep your head up, love. Life, God doesn't throw at you what you can't handle. Yeah. Just keep going. Ask Jesus to help you through whatever situation you're going through. Um, we're praying for we're you. gonna say a prayer for you tonight, you. and just keep your head up, love. We love you, Biha. Yep, it's okay to cry. I know. Um, uh oh, I know who that is. Okay, 
Uh, mama, you want to call? Oh, hold on. No, I can't say. Did I just miss the mukbang? You did. Would he get upset you're sharing? Well, he already tried commenting in here saying, wow, something um, sad, story. sad story or interesting story or something like that. But to be honest, that's my story. And if you're not ready to accept how I feel or to talk about how I feel, bye. I asked you not to follow my YouTube. Um, don't follow what I do. If it, uh, if it doesn't concern your kids, don't be up in my videos. I'll call you when your kids need something. Um, you call me if you want to talk to your, Hello, to your kiddos. Oh. Look then. Okay. Alright. Oh. Slow, baby. Um, where was I? Oh, yeah. I'll contact you if your kids want to talk to you. Or you can contact me when your kids want to talk. Text me and I'll ask them if they want to talk to you. I'll call you back. Irene, you're a bad baby. <laughs> La Fala, it's only up from here. Bendiciones and much love to you, the boys and word, and you got this. Thank you, Isai Isi. I hope you I said that right. Thank you. Oh man, my bad. Busy getting the kids ready for bed. No problem, Casey. We have always been taught stay and work it out, but it's when God says, get up and go. You deserve better. Melissa, 14 years of I uh, I'll just leave it at that. I don't want to bash him. No, um, Peachy, she he did not cheat on me that I know of. No. Nope. None of that. Thank God, because I think I would have been more mad and hurt. But no, he did not say that. I don't know if that's the reason why he would. He just said he was unhappy and felt like we were two different people that didn't understand, and that's okay. I can live with that. Aries, yes, I got my bedroom set. Just repolished, etc. And it looked brand new. Yup. <laughs> he had his notification on, huh? Boy, unsubscribe, unmod, all that. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. V, do you have any plans for your birthday, love? Yes, Casey. It's over. Irene, you're stronger than you feel. Everything will be all right. Thank you, Aria. Thank you, CJ's mommy, La Vanishita. Thank you, Diana. Thank you, Endless Love. Thank you, Jasmine. Everything will be okay. Exactly, Robert. He was a good guy. I'm not going to lie. He was very patient. Uh, there was just a lot of things that... I don't want to say no more because I don't want to bash him. I don't want to say he should have been this, this, and that. I'm not going to do that. Just We'll leave it at that, at what I said. If you'd like, if you guys like to um, re-watch, I'm okay with that. I'm going to leave it up. Belinda, I had ordered a Taco Bell feast. Tell me why Taco Bell only gave me half my order. Oh, my God. 711 people? Ah! Oh, my God. A great place to buy furniture is Ikea. Yeah, but if I buy furniture, like, I swear, I hate that. Um, I like the marble look on things, but you guys know that paper, it lifts up, and underneath, it's, like, all kinds of shredded Wood, I don't want that. Oh, I hate, I can't stand that kind of material. We understand, so it is what it is. Move forward. Yes, exactly. Thank you, Robert. Hi, Wally. You did miss the food, buddy. I had half of, um, half my order of Taco Bell and some Maruchan noodles. I got um, the grilled cheese burrito, which was pretty good. I had nachos. And they did not put my chalupa. They did not put my Doritos taco or my extra cheese. So I was mad. 
Thank you, Leslie. You're stronger, and I'm sure you will get through this. Thank you, Chris. Girl, you're beautiful. There is going to be no problem once you get on that dating train. Prayers for you. Thank you. Thank you, Francisco. You better get your... Yeah, I told him. Like, I swear, I was I wanted to go back right there and then, but I had already set up right here. And I said, by the time I drive back in traffic, my food's going to be soggy. So I was like, oh, well. Yep, my children do know. I'm very upfront with my kids. I don't hold no secrets um, unless it's something that I feel kids don't need to know. But it's something they needed to know. They needed to hear the truth so that way they don't say later on, Mommy lied to me or... I don't want them to resent me or anything like that. And yeah, you should do a series on your healing process on YouTube. Okay, so the first week um, I cried like a baby because it was it was depressing and hurtful. Not not even the first week, a couple days and then a couple days I couldn't talk about it to you guys. And today's the first day that I'm able to talk about it and be okay about it. And yeah, I didn't mean to write early. Oh, you're good. Oh, Wally. Sorry. Yeah, Jasmine, it's not a breakup though, love. I feel like on my behalf, it's it's for good. I don't want to get back into the same um relationship i don't i want something affectionate romantic i'm a sucker for romance i want um someone to kiss me randomly you know how big is your new place um let's just say it's big enough for the boys are gonna be sharing their room and yeah we are here to support you, grind and take it day by day. Yep, thank you. I am keeping my head up. I. Sh you should get child support for your kids, my friend. I can't do that to him. I don't want to be a mean person and add that stress. If he wants to help support, buy them shoes, get them haircuts. Um, give me money for their well-being. I'm okay with that. But if not, I'm not going to ask. Oh, my gosh. Shayna. Shayna just gave me a super chat of $100. Oh, my goodness. For your new crib. Oh, my gosh. Thanks. Celebrate the first super chat from Shayna. Oh, my gosh. Thank you, Shayna. I appreciate you. Aww. <clears throat> Oh my gosh, and I've never seen I've never even seen you chat, my love. Wow, God bless you. Thank you so much. Oh, I love that mama is moving with y'all. Y'all live together. Yep. My grandma's going with me. Vanessa, what kind of person doesn't like to be romantic? I want to be kissed without having to ask for a kiss. I want somebody to give me a hug without me asking for a hug. I like to be told beautiful without asking, do I look beautiful today? Shouldn't your significant other do that out of the, because they want to? Yeah. He was a good man in some categories, but the way he would call you lazy all the time in a joking way irritated me. Felicia, yeah, I, it's okay, though. In a way, I like to be a couch potato. I ain't going to lie. But if my house is clean and things are done, I'm not going to... What am I going to do? You want what is... You want what is best for you and what you deserve. We all deserve love and attention. Yep. And I feel like... I wasn't getting that. And maybe he wasn't getting that either. I sacrificed a lot, you guys. Um, I sacrificed having more children. Um, I sacrificed time in my life where, 
Like, I want more kids. And because he's sick, I was understanding. And, like, I, I don't think that sacrifice was um, appreciated because, I mean, I am in my 30s now, you know, and they, I, I don't know. I feel like I sacrificed a lot and um, it wasn't appreciated, but it's okay. It's okay. It's a new beginning for me. It's a new beginning for him. I, I wish him all the best. Yeah. On my end, it shows you have 700 people watching. Yep, I have 726 26 people in here. Oh, my oh, gosh. I love it. That is crazy. I admire you. You're going to be fine, mija, as long as you in a better place with yourself and the kids. You know? Yep. And that's what I want. I want my kids to be happy. Um, like, I want to tell you guys so much more, but honestly, I don't want to bash him. That's not what this video was about. It's just about an update on where we're at, you know? And there was a lot of... He lacked and I lacked. So, it's okay. We can work on ourselves separated. He can work on... Being a better whatever on his end. And I can work on being a better mom and woman on my end. Just not together. I don't want to do it together. Stop. Truly him leaving is a blessing. He is granting you better blessing and allowing amazing things to come into your life. You're a strong mama. Yep. Thank you. Thank you, V. Oh, the red hearts for Shayna. Yeah. Thank you, guys. You aren't asking for much. Yep. 100% Irene. All women want that. Exactly. Who wants to be asking? Mm-hmm. Exactly, Martha. And that's the thing. During the six months that we were not together, like, I did not cheat on him. He did not cheat on me. It's not about that. But I thought... Those six months were for good. Six months is a long time. I started talking to somebody, and even this person was, like, giving me more attention than he ever has in the whole four, 14 years, you know? And that opened my eyes, like, oh, wow, you know? I don't know. Yes, don't tell us. Keep it entre ustedes. Yeah. I feel like a lot of it should be kept entre nosotros. Um... That's good, Anna. Yep, Maritza. Una nalgada here and there. Exactly. Oh, my gosh. Like, I ain't got a lot of nalgas, but I ain't grab a chiche or algo. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry if there's kids watching, pero dang. Oh, yep, at least it happened now better than later. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> yep, I, I agree. It's time for me to focus on me. Oh. Your true love will come. Yeah, I'm a, Your true love so will come. you both have split before. How do you know you both won't reconcile? Marina. The the split before we got married was his decision to. He left because, because he wanted to. He didn't even give me an explanation when he left the first time. He didn't call me until I think it was a couple days or a week later. I can't remember how long it was before. He's like, oh, well, I just don't love you anymore. That really hurt. Like when somebody tells you they don't love you and you've invested so much time and love and effort... Is very hurtful. I was moving on. And he asked me for a second chance. And I said, okay. When I do things, I do it 100%. 100%. I give it my all. I'm very truthful. And we got married. Like, if he really wasn't in love, why marry me? You know? That's how I feel. Like, I don't know. I think he got married for all the wrong reasons. Oh, my gosh. Heck, yes, Maria. If it's the right person, I definitely want another kid. 
Thank you. My shirt says coffee and confidence. Been with my wife going on 17 years. Every time she tries to kiss me, I back away because I'm very shy. She likes to flirt with me all the time. She loves to be romantic. I always back away. So, yeah, that's funny. Where you? Oh, the cat. Oh, the cat. oh they're playing. Oh, Mello, you playing with Peanut. It was funny because uh, the the puppy was walking around and the and he was trying to bite the middle cat, which is a, a girl, like not bite but pouncing on her and trying to play, and the boy cat wasn't having. It. He's like, Ch -ch -ch -ch. I'm like, dang, smacking his head, and the puppy backed up and it was like, Woof. oh, it was so cute. It's so cute. <laughs> I'm getting I'm getting a divorce too, Erin. I feel you. Oh, Dina, I'm sorry, hun. Well, not sorry if it's better, you know. Um, Monica, I have not right now. Um, I'm going through another a different process. Um, I have an appointment on the first, but it's not for the divorce yet. There's something that we were doing together that I want to pull out of. I don't want nothing to do um, with him anymore. May, um, God bless him and all for the better. Anyways, he told me he found another way, so I'm happy for him. Yes, new memories. Yep. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I am so excited. Oh, my gosh. You don't even know. Yes, as long as the kids and you are in a better place now, then everything else will work out. You're not the first or last, so bailante, mija. You have many blessings and prayers your way. Yup, I'm not the first or last that's going through it. If other women could go through it, I can too. Dang, I'm so far behind on there. Hi, Chef Thai Queen. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I've noticed your name, but I haven't even said hi. Hi, my beautiful. 723. Oh my Sheesh. Marina, no, I don't ever want to get back with him. Then that would be me being desperate. And I'm not desperate. If they told me once they didn't love me, they told me twice that they weren't happy, it was fake, I'm not going back a third time. No. <laughs> Endless love, I can. Thank God I can. This sobra chi chi, we need a squeeze here and there. Exactly, <laughs> verdad, Marta? Dang. Hi, Gabby. How are you, beautiful? Hi, Gabby. No, Jason. Um, not much. Um, it was. It's. It's always been like that. And honestly, I'm tired of it. I'm tired of asking, and it, it's something that we have. I have um, brought to his attention, like, but there's always an excuse. I like be someone to surprise me with, even if you have to pick a rose off the side of the street, a little flower, something like that, I would be happy with, but no. <laughs> Diana. Oh. Yep, I agree, Stephanie. Hi, Madeline. Thank you for joining us. I feel you. About two years ago, I was in an abusive relationship, and I never got the attention I wanted or needed. But eventually, I had the courage to leave him, and I never, I've never been this happy. Oh, I'm so sorry. Thank God that our relationship wasn't abusive. Um, that's hard. I've seen firsthand. Uh, um abuse like that and it's scary so that's why I've never been abusive with him and he's never been with me and I, I thank him for that you know because he could have been a whole different way but no never never in the entire relationship has put his hands on me he's called me out of my names but who hasn't it's okay Yes, 
I'm in a relationship with my baby daddy of eight years, and I know that feeling when you don't get the affection you've always craved for. I realized I'm not in love. I'm just attached. Yeah. Yep. I, I think that's what it is. And uh, it's a big, um, you care for the person because they're the father of your children. And um, Jason, maybe if, if um, the person does it the right way, like I would love to get proposed to. Um, I've never been proposed to. Um, I would like to. Have someone, um, actually them, yeah, I would like to be proposed to, maybe. Jasmine, I ain't even worried about the money, girl. My my ex, my baby daddy didn't even really, the 14 years, he had a couple of jobs, I'm not going to lie. But, like, really, really, no. Like, I've always been the main Provide. supporter, provider for... Me, him, and the kids. God has been the main provider, but I mean, like, yeah. So maybe, hopefully, was Omar sick when you married him? Yeah. Yep. Bye, Vic. Thank you for joining us, my beautiful. I hope you have a blessed rest of your day. God bless you. Mm -hmm. I agree, Vanesita. Mija, que bueno que... Te limitas a no decir todo. Eso habla muy bien de ti. Te deseo todo lo mejor. Te lo mereces. Un fuerte abrazo. Oh, Gracias, Mary. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Guess who's in here? Who? Beach Bunnies, the one that gave you the name <laughs> Warden. Hi, oh, my gosh. Hi, Beach Bunnies. I haven't seen you in forever. Oh, how are you? Are you freezing? I did it. Wasn't she the one that said she lives in Nogales or no? No, I don't know. She lives in Mexico somewhere, huh? I don't know. Yeah, she does. I don't know. Are you cold, beautiful? I bet you it's freezing over there. Beach bunnies. That's exactly how I feel right now. That's exactly how I feel right now. Tasha, no, I bought it. I'm not giving it back. And you know what's, oh my God, you guys are not going to believe this. Okay, so before the six months, I put our wedding rings on layaway. I found his size and my side in gold bands, no lie. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Every month I would give a little payment. I finally paid him off. Tell me why. He left the six months. I said, forget that. Well, I'm not getting back. So I went in. Sold them back to to the pawn shop that I was laying them away from. <laughs> so and now I swear I kid you not. I put I found another gold band in my size and his size. Put them on layaway, and this happens. That's God telling me it wasn't meant to be. So I said, okay, forget it. I told the pawn shop I don't want the layaway no more. But ain't that crazy? I can't. Oh, uh, thank you. Eat with Jess. No, 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 no. Yeah. It is better, but the sacrifices us women make go unappreciated, and I actually backfires at you. It hurts. Yep. Exactly, Drizzle. Listen, oh, never mind, I don't know what I said. you deserve better, even if it's being happy alone. I know marriage. You go through a lot of ups and downs, but the first time should have been the last time. Best wishes for you both, cuz. Thank you, cousin. The first time should have been the last time. You remember how hurt I was, cuz. And I felt bad, and I said, okay, maybe he was feeling this way because he's sick. I gave excuses for him when I shouldn't have. All these get child support comments, just evil and gold digging behaviors. Omar's a good person. This has nothing to do with being a bad parent. Exactly, B. Exactly. I do not want to do that to him. It's okay if he felt he don't feel a certain way about me. That's fine. Like I said, if he does want to buy his kids shoes, take them for buy him a haircut. I'm okay with that. But I'm not gonna be like, uh uh. You know? No, I'm not gonna do that. Vera, that's exactly how I felt. 
that's exactly how I felt, but I can't force the love. Force the love. I can't force him to be with me forever. And I'm not just gonna sit back and and sacrifice feeling in the being in love, you know. I was committed to him. I've never never cheated on him. I've never spoken to a man or woman um with the intent of lust in any way jokingly okay y'all have seen my lives where i'm like oh karin leon is sexy as heck singers don't count because lord knows there's no way we're gonna get with them singers so that was all fun and whatever but in real in all reality like anybody off of any social media i've never talked to anybody during our marriage and but it's okay Lady, yo tenía tres, and it was hard, but no matter what, it's possible. You just got to want it and feel good about it. Exactly. Oh, that's beautiful, Anna. Yes, ma, I went through it, and now I'm happy you got this girl. Thank you. Oh, Bang man. the song Flowers by Miley Cyrus. Girl, I was yesterday. <laughs> oh. What, mama? A huevo. A huevin. <laughs> yup, exactly. And Christina, I didn't even know that was by Miley Cyrus. And I was listening to the words. I was like, oh, shit, she right. Shoot. Oh, shit. Vivian, yes, of course he's still sick. Um, it's okay though. Hi, honey. Uh, Rosarito Beach, Mexico. Cold as heck. Yep. I knew she was in Mexico. My sister lives in Ogales and it's freezing there. Sorry if I'm shouting, I'm getting a little. Gabby says, I love you, Irene. It took me a while to find a great guy and he came into my life with. Even a notice. And now I'm happy once again. I know you can overcome this because you're beautiful and strong. Thank you so much, Gabby. Thank you, Gabby. I appreciate all your guys' uh, kind words. I was kind of nervous because I was like, no. They're going to say, like, like be really mean about it. I that's, that's my intent. I know most of you know. But you know who I'm talking about. Like the T-R-O-O-L or whatever. Double yeah. Girl, now that you're famous, you got to pick and choose who you want to date, right? <laughs> I am not famous, girl. Ugh. Your man should be getting a ring. Yeah. But I did all that because I know he ain't got an income. Vivian, yeah, I read your message. Irene, if he wants to eventually get back together, will you give it another chance? No. Nope. No I'm more. done. I'm done. He's hurt me one too many times. A person can't, their heart can only take so much. Stacy, I was not close to them. Like, I rarely liked going over there because. Don't say nothing. No, no, I'm reading a comment. Um. I was always told they loved me and she has helped us a lot because her son never worked, you know? Well, no, I'm not going to say that. He worked, but um, she's helped us a lot when we've needed it and it's appreciated. I appreciate that so much. I'm not trying to bash them at all, but um, I had a couple comments from siblings that were like... Um, not happy that their mom was paying for Hi, the lawyer. And no, Jasmine, I'm not going to cry. Um, And it was kind of like, really, why are you like throwing shade at me? And let, mind you, this person is underage. Like, why are you throwing shade at me if you don't? It's not my responsibility to pay for that. You know, I don't know. It's just it's OK, though. Um, but yeah, I wasn't really close to them. They did help 
I'm not gonna lie, they did help us um, monetarily um, when I didn't have an income from YouTube. Um, but they haven't helped in a long time. Um, and it's not their responsibility, it's their sons and mine, but I needed help and they helped. So I'm appreciative, but we weren't close, if that makes sense. It's only right to dream about seeing your shoe, especially that he was singing um, Let's Just Kiss and Say Goodbye in Spanish. Woo! That song melted my heart. <laughs> Be glad it was after four, almost 15 and not 50 years, yeah? Ay, ay, ay. Exactly, Crystal. Too young to be unhappy. Life is too short, yep. I love how Warden finishes your sentence. I swear, that woman can read my mind or something. I don't know. <laughs> I'm over here with the teacher, mija. Jason, I showed him my phone. I have nothing to hide. He knows I'm a loyal person and I am not a cheater. And it's not because of... Um, no opportunities is because I don't roll like that. And let's love. I'm strictly <sighs> weekly. Can't say it because my son's right there, but yeah. And let's love. I have to go, but if you like or ever need someone to talk to, just message me on Facebook or Instagram. Thank you, my beautiful Brooke. Aw, thank you, Brooke. Aw, Estelle said, Irene, something my sis would tell me. A woman's heart should be so close to God that a man should chase him to find you. Amen. You deserve the utmost for you and your sons. God bless. Wow, I like that. That's beautiful. A woman's heart should be so close to God that a man should chase God to find you. Aww. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Amethyst. I appreciate you, love. See, Gladys, but well, that's the thing. I did want it. It's, it's just, he did it, and I'm not going to force it, and I'm okay with it now. I'm so happy for you regarding your new place, regarding your other situation. God is with you, and with the support of your family, all will be well. Love you and your family. Thank you so much. I'm super excited. Are you excited? For, for our new place. Yeah. Yeah. So, to, to what happened? Don't say nothing that's going to give any hints away, Pop, because we got to keep that private. Not because of all these beautiful people here, but I for... Say was how many rooms are in there. Um, I don't want to say because they can look up. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if this is um, bad or not. Juana said, Grandma Warden, me teche no, sino que el apoyo de ella. What does that mean? Is that bad or no? No. No? Oh. Mom, look at Peanut. No creo, no. Okay. She's just saying that el apoyo de ella. Mama. Oh, that you're not a metiche. Oh, that you're not a metiche, that you're my apoyo? Yeah. Oh, I got it. I didn't understand. I was like, ah. <laughs> Gracias, Juana. Look at Peanut. Peanut. Me, me. I haven't worked since 2015. Hubby worked so hard to make sure we have everything. It's hard for a man when they can't provide for his family. I'm sure he feels bad. But in married, you have to be. 
I'll keep coming in and out of the chat, hoping you will still be here. Oh, Kelsey, I'm about to end it right now, love. I'm not eating nothing, no more. I think I'm done. Um, let's see um, when I can do. I think I got to do another video soon. I don't Oh, I think we're going to do the video of the hot dogs. No? My stomach has been hurting. Oh, when you. Okay, when Christopher feels good, we'll do the um, hot dog. Do Did you do a tour yet or do they let you after the application is approved? I did do the tour and my application was approved. I'm just waiting for my move-in date. Okay, thank you guys so much for being here. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for talking with me. A lot of you had a lot of really nice things to say and I appreciate that. Thank you guys for understanding. And for being respectful of the situation I was in, I just felt like um, I wanted to be open with you guys. Um, that way you guys know. And I'm not like trying to be snappy every time I see where's Omar or nothing like that. So thank you guys so much for being understanding. I love you guys so much. God bless each and every one of you. Prayers to everybody that's watching, that's going through something. Um, I pray that God... Um, gives you guys blessings and I pray that you guys uh, give your guys stress and issues to God so that way he can handle them um, because we're not meant to handle our problems God's our handler so I love you guys and thank you for being here I'll see you guys all in the next one you guys want to say bye, bye let me say peanut so they could see peanut on our way out peanut <laughs> Oh my god, look at his fat belly. <laughs> Say hi, baby. Say hi. Belly. No, because then you can see his wiener. <laughs> Bye, Gabby. Thank you, my beautiful. Bye, guys. Will Love you guys all wiener? so much. Huh? Will it cover his wiener? Oh, Christopher wants me to show you guys his fat belly, but then I'm touching now. I gotta wash my hands. <laughs> we gotta cover the private parts. Look at his fat belly, though. <laughs> Oh, Lord, he's fat. Did you just get the needy? Huh? Oh, bye, guys. Bye, guys. Cover that booty, peanut. Good night.